company business. From small and medium enterprises to large corporate entities, and guaranteed, it was represented at the Uganda Matters Shrine in Mugongo today. <laughs> Cobblers, outfitters, food vendors to mention but a few. They all convened at the shrine, their aim, making a profit. Whether they managed to achieve this all boiled down to individual businesses. <laughs> One thing stood out though, the fact that majority of the businesses did not make as much as they had anticipated, a factor that they largely blame on the high poverty levels in the country. What people are saying that uh, they are poor. Somebody can, somebody want to buy something like uh, five liters of juice. It's almost uh, something like uh, seven hundred. But somebody is giving you three hundred. However, much as the crowds of people did not serve to benefit the local entrepreneurs, they still cannot be ignored and focus should instead be placed on religious tourism. Every year you get multiple increase of, in numbers. That informs us that this place, the design, the architecture, the attraction, the ambience, the, the road network, the communication system, all has to change to fit the modern times and the taste of the modern tourist centers. So we can attract the whole world here if we put in more investment. It's not business as usual here today in Namugongo, as traders and businessmen came with the intention of making a killing, but very few can boast of making great profits. Not even the huge amounts of people we saw trickling in today could guarantee great sales. I'm Ingrid Nantege, and now I hand you over to Gashu Tumusume Uwitware, who will bring you the day's activities in pomp and color.